So there's no denying that yeah apple valley has some of the great uh shopping centers we just stopped by to the juice bar here in um jess ranch shopping center uh, to pick us up some smoothies i got the super green which is pretty awesome which one did you get jasmine strawberry chip and jasmine got strawberry chip mm. pretty good and it's sweet it's made with coconut milk it's super good so I wanted hmm. Hmm. and it's right next to the 24-hour fitness the juice bar and they have salads and wraps and other food items to go which is pretty cool because it's right next to the gym uh, the 24-hour fitness here in Jess Ranch so yeah if you're uh, moving up to uh, the high desert, you're probably looking uh, into moving to Apple Valley, okay? And you're probably thinking, why don't I move to Apple Valley and actually buy a house with acres, or maybe like an acre, a half an acre, or more along of getting a bigger uh, property out here in the high desert? since you're already gonna be moving here, right? So that's what this video is gonna be. I'm gonna show you a couple of properties that have an acre or under an acre. So that way you can see how it is to eat, sleep, and live up here in Apple Valley, California. So that's what we're gonna be doing, all right? So we're passing all of the shopping centers here. And Jess Ranch. We're on the corner of Apple Valley and Bear Valley. Shopping centers that way. There's the four, four corners here are full of food, shopping, dining, everything that you're gonna be needing. Needing if you're gonna be moving here to Apple Valley. Now, Apple Valley is known for having like I said, some of the best shopping uh, centers here in the high desert. And we, it's more because of safety too. Not saying that um, the high desert is not safe. I'm just saying that it's more of a desirable area when it comes to feeling uh, safer out here and shopping out here in the high desert. And that's why I wanted to bring you um, this information. Now, we're going to be seeing different um, neighborhoods and areas of where you could buy these properties that have more of a land for you to buy. But you're going to know, have to keep in mind that you're going to be driving a little bit downer from even the shopping centers. Maybe 10 minutes, um, 8 minutes away from all of the shopping centers here in... Um, Apple Valley and you're still you still see a lot of land here look at all that open land
already considering moving to the high desert and you're thinking Apple Valley is a good option for you, yeah, you're going to be able to find some good sized land if you're still looking for it. But I'm not, not only that, but you're going to find good sized land. You're going to find uh, some newer construction homes and some older homes on an acre. And you're also going to, going to find that they're really close to all of the major shopping here in the area. And the schools, which is really great. So why not consider buying a house with a more of a property? So maybe you can have a homestead or you can have whatever you might uh, be thinking about. Maybe a shop. you're a person that feels that maybe an HOA is not the right thing for you you know maybe you you should consider moving a little bit out of the city now Apple Valley is located probably like 15 probably like 15 to 25 minutes if you're not in traffic from the 15 freeway up Bear Valley Road. It's gonna take you 15 to 20 minutes to get to Apple Valley. Now, if you add another 10 minutes to get from Jess Ranch to maybe this property here, so that's gonna take you, what, maybe 25 minutes to get from the 15 freeway down to your, um, your home that you're gonna be buying. Look at the mountains. Stater Brothers. This is Navajo Road and Bear Valley Road. And this is the high school right here. Look at the high school. Can you imagine the stadium on a Friday night during a football game? Can you say Friday night lights? Yes, in the high desert, people enjoy football they make it into a big event with food trucks and other items trust me you're gonna love So yes, this is where the AMC Theater is located at here in Apple Valley, California, which is kind of weird because in this plaza, I had came to the theater once when I looked it up online and I actually thought the theater was closed because there was nobody parked in front. So the only business in the shopping center is the AMC Theater, which I mean, it's close to the high school. But there's really nothing else to really do in that shopping center. Because everything else is closed down.
guys that there's flood there's signs that say flood so when it rains the road will is i guess it floods with water so that's always something for you to keep in mind when you're looking when you're buying a house is always look at everything that you are going to be getting into look at this road now we're in a dirt road here what you're gonna have to consider is if you want that land oh, we shouldn't oh. right there looks promising i don't think so what if we get stuck i don't think we will we'll get closer over there good Oh god, what if we make a wrong decision? I don't know. That even looks better over there. You know, I got and the here. water. Okay. Go back, go back, go back. Yeah, go through there and then go through that side. Okay. Okay, yeah, so this is things to consider when you're buying a house and it's gonna have more land. Look at the road here, guys. Go, go upper. Oh. You're gonna have to pay attention to everything, guys, because look, uh, the road floods here. You're gonna need a bigger car. If you're gonna be considering buying a property out here with more land, this is the type of things that you're gonna be having to take into consideration. So I thought it was very important for me to give you this video. So that way you can be better oh informed of what you're really going to be expecting when you're moving up to Apple Valley and you want more there. land. <laughs> no, that corner. Sure. Yeah. Do whatever he's going to do. Hold on. Your street names right here. Yeah. This is the pole. But look at this house. Beautiful new home here. Two stories. This is the back. Oh, this is the back? Yeah, this is the back of the house. <coughs> and look how big the lot is. The lot's all the way from the fence. So we're in the back of the property right now. They have big... Yes. here you it looks like you're gonna be on propane and you're gonna be in a septic okay and how do I know this guys because as you could see we're on a dirt road and there's no city sidewalks so that's gonna give you a little bit of more information that you're probably gonna your property is gonna be on a septic is because you don't see the city sidewalks 
you'd have seen the, the drain for the city so this is the property here guys as you can see it's a new construction it uh, built in uh, 2022 okay guys so yeah so this property here it's listed for four hundred and fifty thousand. it's a four bedroom two bathroom it's a thousand eight hundred and thirty five square feet it was built in 2022 it has central heating central air conditioning it's on 0 0.91 acres and this property is going to cost you $245 per square feet so that's a a pretty good deal okay so I guess th this property is zoned for maybe uh, horses if you like that or if you're into uh, biking the off-roading of course because of the dirt road right but it's zoned for a lot of different things and yeah this is a new construction that's why I wanted to bring you out here just so you can get a better feel of yeah you can have that acre lot but you're gonna be having to come down a little more from Jess Ranch like where all the shopping is centrally located you're gonna have to be coming up down a little more either on the east the west side of Apple Valley or the south side I think that's what it is so I hope you uh, can see I'm gonna drive a little bit up in this neighborhood so you can get a better feel of how it is to eat uh, to live here and also give you some more information about the community and about the property nice open floor plan with the granite countertops stainless steel appliances and look at the master bathroom everything about the property okay so this is what get this is what you can get that's almost that's an acre out here in the high desert in apple valley california <laughs>
enjoy my juice. I'm gonna show you the drive back down to Jess Ranch. And if anything is, if I see anything else that I wanna tell you, I'll go ahead and I'll let you guys know, okay? But this is how it is to live out here in Apple Valley if you're looking to, hold on, if you're looking to buy a home on an acre or more, this is probably what you're gonna be looking into, is, especially if you want a newer house, okay? Uh, they're gonna be out more, out to um, the rural side of Apple Valley, okay? So, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'm gonna continue eat, drinking my, my juice bar uh, drink. Mm. It's super good. Definitely check that out if you come up to Apple Valley. And I'm gonna take you down with us. So just enjoy the ride, okay? Empty, empty lots 
to be here. school guys. We have high schoolers before they're going to be going to school. 